You were also involved in one of the biggest hits on television from the 70s and the 80s, Three's Company. Can you talk about how you first got associated with that? Yeah, as I said, Don Tafner had represented uh, Thames Television in the United States. And after we made the movie, after I made it with Herman Rush, we decided to go our separate ways. We were perfect, we were good friends. We, we split up. And Tafner, who we had licensed the formats from, uh, came to me and said, I've got more formats that uh, I'll go in partnership with you and you present them to the networks. And one of them was uh, a show called Man About the House. Man About the House was the story of a boy living with two girls in the same apartment uh, as a comedy. And it was a big hit in London. And I took that to the three networks and each one of them turned me down because they said, you can't have a boy living with two girls on our network. The standards and practices people refused to okay the format while the program people thought it was great, but they couldn't get it going. And I was about to give up on that when Freddie Silverman called me one day and said, uh, you still have that show with the boy and the two girls? I said, yeah. He said, I want to develop it. It's a breakthrough show. I said, how can you? Your standards and practices people have turned it down. He said, let me worry about that. I said, fine, we'll develop it. So we put out, got a writer to write a, a, um, a pilot script for an American version of the show. And uh, that didn't work out. He, we did a pilot when I was with Herman Rush for Eisner in New York that didn't work either. And... Uh, Eisner said, uh, why don't we get Larry Gelbart to write the, the pilot script? And Larry Gelbart had just quit MASH. He'd done MASH all the years that it was on and had decided it was time to leave and do a Broadway show, which he wanted to write. And uh, I went to Gelbart and I showed him the British pilot of Man About the House. And he said, look, I'm through with television. I've done five or six years of that. I don't want to do any more television. I said, look, Larry, will you write the pilot script, that adapt this British show? He said, sure, I'll do that. And he said, but I'm going to throw an impossible figure at you. I said, what's that? He said, I want $50,000 to write the pilot script. I said, well, let me see if ABC will go for it. I went back to ABC, Business Affairs. They said, no way. We've never paid that kind of money for a pilot script. About half an hour later, ABC Business Affairs called me back, George Reeves, and said, Silverman says, pay the 50000 so I told Larry that we were going to pay him $50,000 to adapt the script, and he did. And they saw the script and decided they wanted to make a pilot, and I got Larry to agree to work with me to, to uh, produce the pilot. And we had a line producer, Don Van Atta, who worked with us. The three of us produced the pilot of Free's company.